hello and welcome back in this short lecture we're gonna learn about how we can add a group of users to a specific security group let's say I have a user account here if I just go to my Azure Active Directory and the groups I do have here a group called uh, Paddy Lab P2 licenses so this group is used to assign the licenses uh, based on the members so what I can do is if I want to add I can go here and add the required user accounts let's say one by one like these I can add uh, the required accounts but maybe uh, instead of you know adding manually what if if you have an option to add as a bulk operation so that's what we're gonna try to do now within this lecture so to do that what I'm gonna do is I'll just go to the the required group and click on bulk activities import members so you will be given a sample template uh, where you can download and for example this is a template which I open and you see here uh, it talks about the uh, object ID all I have to give is every user account object ID I have to give so how do you get this so you can get the object ID from your PowerShell or maybe from you or from the from the console so let me show you how to get that object ID uh, just go to the users and the bulk activities and say import or the download the user account so it's going to download uh, this account all the accounts and all the possible information like the first name last name and their type of account including the object id so in the, in this case it's just downloaded i mean it's ready for us to download so i'll simply download by clicking here so if you see here i'm going to get a file open up with all the information including the object ID if you see here so I can simply take the required uh, computer uh, comp uh, required user account say in this case I wanted to play with only few accounts let's say I wanted to just work on only these specific accounts which are close to 11 objects so all these object IDs I can simply copy here and I'll go back to the uh, sample which I have given uh, for group import members sample so I'll simply paste here from the example that's it so now I can save this file as uh, some format let's say I wanted to save here group import simply save that's it and now I'll, if I go back to my Azure portal and go to your required groups where you wanted to import all these user accounts so all groups so this is my user group where I wanted to add all the members as a bulk activity so I'll simply import members and this time I have already downloaded and I have pasted all the required object IDs uh, and then browse here and then group import and it's going to import in a minute or so all the user accounts that we have given in the format of object ID this is how you can do the bulk operation the bulk operation is successful and you can check the action also if you want or I'll simply what I'll do is I'll simply close this this is successful and refresh I should be able to see here the user account uh, which are imported now so you can see here all the accounts has been already imported. this is how you can import as a bulk what if if you want to you know really play with the PowerShell the same commands if you remember you know one of the lecture uh, PowerShell uh, lecture which I have already given here if not you can you know go and check the lecture work with PowerShell AD groups creation and Azure AD groups that's the title of the lecture you can go back and simply you all you have to do is you have to connect and then use add Azure AD group member command so the command uh, uh, what I'm gonna do is uh, if you see here I don't have a user account called Tony so th there's no user called Tony but I have actually a Tony's uh, object ID so here also within the PowerShell we will be using the object ID to add so I'm gonna use uh, as the first command so here the object ID is in this case my group object ID I can use a get hyphen as your AD group so in this case paddy lab p2 license so this also have a object ID so I'll just take this ID and uh, I will be actually giving here the command uh, with as your AD group uh, group member the member of that 
object ID is this. So this is the group which is Paddy hyphen lab P2 license. So for this, I wanted to add a reference, uh, a reference object. So object ID in this case, the ID of Mr. Tony is this the account uh, specific object ID. So I'll just enter this so that it's going to add that specific account. And if I just go back to the um, as you PowerShell to retrieve or maybe I can retrieve either way either I can get the uh, Azure AD group object uh, with this number like say get hyphen Azure AD group member with the object called in this case this is an object so I'll just retrieve the members of this object so you see here now the Tony should be there so Tony is added and if I just go back here uh, earlier Tony was not there if you see here Tony is not there if I as soon as I refresh I should be able to get here Tony account also added to the account this is how you're gonna add the objects to your groups I hope this lecture is useful for you thank you for watching this